Hello boys and girls, how you doing? Okay, my back is not there yet for sure. It's gonna take a while, never mind, uh, let's move on. Okay, today pick a card is all about um, are you getting back together? Because a lot of you are in separation, unfortunately, but sometimes, you know, that's the way it's supposed to be for a while. Okay, so two power, and then we uh, know the story, and then we develop, okay? So, one, two, one, two. Okay, so, panel number one. Are you getting back together? Three of Cups, Four of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> It's not a low back issue. Well, one is covering their heart. You both may be covering your heart. You stay in your, on your foundation. You kind of hold on to who you are, where you are. Maybe you hold on to your ego as well. Ego is a big part often of separation. And also maybe maintaining um, status quo in a sense like, okay, I met you, but I was with someone else. So I'm staying put. Uh, you could be the castle out there, but I'm staying here. Yes, three of cups could be third party situation. It's true. So boy, mm -mm. also it could be, a, you know, a desire to actually, you know, date again. It is possible as well. Let's have a look. There's a law of attraction. Yes, but there's a law of battling. Of course, we know that. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, someone wants to rush towards you, definitely. Okay, it's fine. But is it just about desire? Because once we know what I mean, right? <laughs> Whatever, moving on. <laughs> Queen of Pentacles, you are very grounded. You are definitely very grounded and very true, very, you know, sincere. You want stability as well. You don't want fluffing around. You don't want something just physical. What should you do? Yes, you might find a way to find peace, stability, uh, a form of serenity after all the yucky situation. Absolutely, there's a possibility, but you do have to, um, how can I say, balance your emotion, balance that, that you know, um, everything in your life, really. The intensity of the desire as well, if that's possible. But you are, you too, protected. So that will say... Hmm, maybe yes, but yes, something definitely needed to happen. The separation needed to happen because uh, the foundation of your relationship was very, very faulty. It was a shamble, really. If you couldn't carry on, something had to stop in order to start something new. And learning, absolutely, thanks to that or because of it. You learn, both of you. Maybe you talk to a mentor, to a therapist, to read some book, talk to a very good friend. Actually, you're trying to learn how to balance the situation because it can't just be the way it was. If it starts again, it has to be different. Absolutely. Yes, it's a slow process, maybe, but there's a will to actually go for it at the end of the day. What did I say? Why do I need the, why do I need the cards? Yes. There's a desire to go for it no matter what because um, you're taking a leap of faith. You don't have all the answers. Even though you study, you worked on yourself, you worked on whatever, you're going for it because you know there's an opportunity here, there's a potential and you can't, you know, mess with this. At the end of the day, you will learn as you go along. And um, and it's something that is, yeah, you can't stay at distance for very long. You know where you're going. The how is not relevant. You know what you know, and simple like that. And if you need to, you know, uh, talk a bit more about what happened, uh, maybe there were some lies, um, or maybe you were lying to yourself or needed to do some work on yourself, whatever needs to be revealed needs to come up because at least you can talk, you know, at least you can have a conversation and learn from each other alone about yourself. Someone was definitely on the fence, so I think there was a third party situation. So there was a lot, a lot of obstacle, definitely. But here you go. If you're a twin flame, whether you, you know, go into that thing. Twin flame is a bit of a trend sometimes. But at the end of the day, it's the idea of it's love is not straightforward sometimes. Sometimes there's a lot of hurdles. And particularly in 2020, it's definitely not straightforward. So, yeah, it's a bit of a mission to get there. But I think it is worth trying again. It's definitely something um, needed to happen. 
and uh, you know both ways in a sense like you needed to be a shamble maybe to start over again and to be built in a on a on a stronger foundation so i would say yes it's definitely a chance to go back together okay so part number two number two <laughs> It's a low back, okay? I'm gonna, you know, it's a low back. Not me, it's just a low back. <sighs> Ten of Wands, Six of Pentacles, Two of Wands. Yes, I would say, well, I would say yes, because, um, yes, yeah, a decision to make. Are we going or are we not going? Simple as that. Or there's a choice between two. Or there's an idea of waiting. There's an idea of dropping. And if you drop a heavy weight off your shoulder, it's maybe as well thinking, you know what, in this relationship, I tried everything. I don't ever think I could, and it's still not working. So at the end of the day, I'm going to just like give up, right? You could read it that way. Or, because we are positive, right? Maybe we can try to make it work, but it has to be equal give and take. And it has to be transparent. Or you can say, yeah, I don't want this relationship anymore because I want a new relationship where it is transparent. Or... I don't want to carry on the way it was. I want this relationship to work, but in a different way. Okay, let's have more cards and we figure out which way is going. Well, it's definitely going because this is the best card of the old day, the sun. So it's a lot of joy, it's a lot of happiness. It's reconnecting with your inner charm because when you're together, you're very good together. Yes, there's a lot of limiting belief uh, that you create yourself in your mind. So obviously it was going to reflect on the other one and vice versa. So that brings a lot of heaviness. Absolutely. Procrastinating, yes. So, you know, you were both waiting. Not great. It's not going anywhere really. Waiting didn't really bring anything. But sometimes, yes, you need to pause in order to reflect. Agreed. But we're not going to spend Christmas over this, are we? Mm -hmm. Right, yeah. Because you create a lot of anxiety. When you don't know, your mind is going like, Ooh, you know crazy so no of course you want to start and you want to start and build something long term so i would say as long of course as there is an equal give and take and a transparency of course otherwise no point but is it a new love or is it that love well someone needs to open their heart and say what they actually feel i think that person is so hiding um, behind hundreds of walls, um, they don't even want to admit they have butterfly, but they have to. They have to purge, and you both have to purge to know what you want, what you don't want. Absolutely. Aww. Yes, it's a love. So that could be love at first sight. So that could be someone new. Still, we don't really know. Or that could be. <laughs> it's not helping, is it? <laughs> Thank you, Axel. Mm -hmm. uh, so that could be a new love, or that could be. Okay, let's restart again. Let's try to see. Yeah, something is definitely ending. But that's not telling me which one. <laughs> I'm terrible. Oof, it's a low back. A low back is painful. Okay. So anyway, the pain is over. Let's just concentrate. The pain is over. That's the main thing, right? So the good stuff is coming your way. Yes. Okay. But is that a new thing? Always going back to <laughs> the one you were with. Okay. Having I mean, giggle now, that's not helping. Right, okay, so the thing is, you both needed to retreat to be in your cave. <laughs> I don't even drink. So it's not even at all. Something definitely has to be completed. A cycle. Okay, fine. That doesn't tell me if it's a... Right, okay, now I know. <laughs> right, so now you both ready at the same time. This is not tower, this is comedian. Okay, um, so you're both ready at the same time. And so now you can, you know, be on the starting block and go on this venture together. So I think, yes, you're going back together, but on a new base. Yes, that would check it. Never had a tarot reading like this. I have to confess on this one. Sorry about that, but at least... I hope it's contagious, the madness or the laughter or whatever it is. <laughs> At the end of the day, it's great news. Everything's perfect except the low back and except that madness. But everything is gorgeous, beautiful. I'm going to come down before tomorrow. <laughs> Hopefully. And yeah, have a great day because I think I'm, I'm really going to 
cool it down, cool it down. Have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Ciao.